Hello and welcome to a short video showing the installation and registration of Barbicana's Full Monty Schedule Risk Analysis software for Microsoft Project. The topics covered in this video include obtaining and installing the trial software. The trial software is fully functional for 30 days from installation. After 30 days, it changes to academic mode where it can continue to be used, but only on schedules of less than 100 tasks. To continue with unrestricted functionality, a license key must be purchased and registered with the software. Finally, the video will cover installing a software update. To download the trial software, visit our website at barbicana.com and follow the links to request the trial. The trial software is in fact the full version of the software and is fully functional for 30 days. After 30 days, the software will change to academic mode with functional restrictions, including a limit of 100 tasks in the schedule, unless a purchase license key is registered with the software. Complete the form to request a download link to be emailed to you. After you complete the form, you should receive an email within a few minutes. If you do not, please verify that the email was not consigned to your spam folder and that you entered the correct email address in the form. Within a few minutes of submitting the trial software request, you should receive an email from Barbicana's Full Monty support system. If you do not, please again check your spam junk email folders. The email contains a link to the Full Monty software download page. It also contains links to the various installation, user, and getting started guides. Click on the main download link and you will be taken to the Barbicana website to access the requested software. The download page again includes links to documentation as well as links to older versions of the software. We recommend installing the latest software unless you are required to use an older version for contractual compatibility reasons. Download the software. The Full Monty installer will require administrator rights to complete the installation. We do recommend using a real administrator account rather than run as administrator. When the download is completed, launch the installer. If you are prompted for user access control permissions, please allow the installation to proceed. Click through the installation wizard to complete the installation. We recommend accepting the default installation location, though this can be changed if necessary. Once the installation is complete, you may close the download page. To verify a successful installation, launch Microsoft Project and navigate to the add-ins menu. There should be an icon for Full Monty and a Full Monty administration menu. 
you are now ready to perform a schedule risk analysis. As previously mentioned, the software is fully functional for a 30-day trial period. After 30 days, the software changes to academic mode unless a purchase license key is registered with the software. The status of the software can be verified in the About Full Monty dialog. Before the product has first been used, the dialog will display the product is unlicensed. The sample project used in the Getting Started guide can also be opened from the Full Monty administration menu. We can now launch Full Monty. And we can verify that the trial is in progress again by looking at the About uh, Full Monty dialog. It will show the, the date the trial will expire. The demonstration project is pre-configured with plus or minus 25% uncertainty on all task durations, so we are ready to run the risk analysis. And review the results. Here is the finished histogram for the project. As all the uncertainty was symmetrical, plus or minus 25% around the estimated durations, you might have expected that we would have a 50% chance of pro delivering the project on time. Unfortunately, this turns out not to be the case, and we only have a 35% chance of delivering the project on time, even with the symmetrical uncertainty due to the effect of merge bias. We can also view a tornado chart to see which tasks are creating the most uncertainty in the outcome and also where the green bars are visible present opportunities for schedule compression. Full Monty can save data back into Microsoft Project custom fields which we can use to produce custom reports uh, inside Microsoft Project including a risk path analysis where we can see the primary critical path after taking into account uncertainty through to the final delivery milestone. We can also see the secondary, tertiary, and so on, critical paths affecting the final outcome. To convert from the trial to a perpetual license, you must first purchase a license from Barbicana. Licenses can be purchased through our website or by purchase order sent to sales at barbicana.com. After a purchase is complete, you will be provided with a unique numeric serial number. The serial number should be referenced in all communication with Barbicana regarding this software. The serial number can be used to obtain the license information to convert the trial to a perpetual license. On the add-ins menu, go to the Full Monty administration and choose Register Full Monty. If you have already been provided with a license key and licensee name, you can enter them now. Otherwise, you can request a new license key from Barbicana by completing the form. And then send, either send the email or save this data to a small file that you can email to us independently. After submitting this information, you will receive an email. The email will reference your serial number, and it will include a license key, in this case the DF01, etc., and a licensee name. The licensee name is case sensitive and must be entered exactly as shown into the software. Uh, we recommend copy and paste for the license key and if you are typing it take care to differentiate between 0 and O and 1 and capital I. So I have entered the license key and the licensee name and then I can simply click OK. If the registration dialog dismisses successfully then the license has been accepted. You can verify the current status of your license at any time by going to add-ins, full Monty administration, and about full Monty.
here we can see I have a perpetual machine license for this computer. To move the software to a new computer, perhaps during a technology refresh, first remove it from the old computer. This is done through the control panel, programs and features, and look for Barbicana Full Monty. Here we have Barbicana's Full Monty for Microsoft Project. Click Uninstall. Close the control panel. The software can now be installed on the new computer and the original license key reused. There is no need to apply for a new license key for a new computer for anything after Full Monty 2016. If you are upgrading an existing computer to a newer version of Full Monty, then again, all that is necessary is to uninstall the software, as we have just done, and then install the new version. All of your existing settings and license key will be retained. Again, we can verify that by going to Add-ins, Full Monty Administration, About Full Monty. That concludes our quick presentation regarding installing and updating Barbicana's Full Monty for Microsoft Project. Should you have any questions, please email fullmontysupport at barbicana.com or contact sales at barbicana.com regarding licensing. Thank you.